What's up, Vanessa Soldiers? I'm the Alliance. Welcome back to another Friday Fun Day. Today we have How Star Wars The Last Jedi Should Have Ended. This is from Hai Shi, as you guys can see. Some people call it His He, or Hai Shi, or Hai Sh, because, you know, the E might be silent. Whatever the case, I always pronounce it Hai Shi, so that's how I'm going to continue pronouncing it. I think it sounds the best, in my opinion, of course. So shout out to all the people here on screen for letting me know about this video. Thank you guys very much. You guys rock. Uh, if you want to check out Heishi's channel, there'll be a link to that in the description below. So in this video, it's not as much as I'm going to be reacting to this video, as I'm going to kind of be doing like a breakdown of the video as well. So whatever scenarios they come up with, I'm going to be comparing them to like what I would want to see, if I agree with them, if I disagree with them. So it's going to be something like that. So bear with me. But if you enjoyed this video, please remember to like, subscribe, and turn notifications to Net Alliance for more Star Wars fun. So with that said, let's begin. She's floating back all of a sudden. Quick, somebody open the door. <laughs> oh no, happy beeps, buddy. Happy beeps. This is Poe Dameron of the Republic Fleet. I have an urgent communication with General Hawk. Destroy that ship. Hello? Right away, sir. Oh, poop. <laughs> yep, that's probably what should have happened. Got enemy fighters closing in. Uh, I certainly have to use the bathroom. <laughs> the chain of command dictates that Admiral Akbar will take command. Because seniority. Excellent! <laughs> Sorry, sister. Yeah, um, a lot of people are really mad at the fact that Akbar died off screen. I do think, I mean, technically he did die on screen, but technically he didn't. So, uh, it, it was just kind of pushed aside, like, and forgot about. Um, for me, I do think it kind of sucks, but I'm not, like, a massive fan of Akbar. I think he's cool, but a lot of people, I think, kind of got a little, a little over offended by that. So, um, I would have been okay if he survived, but I'm not... 100% like I don't I don't 100% hate his death either. I kind of feel like he should have had a more ceremonial one because he is like part of the original trilogy, you know. He should at least yelled it was a trap again before getting killed or he, we should have had something like that and maybe a little bit of a callback, but I don't know. It, it it's up in the air. I'd rather not do this right now. Yeah, me too. Oh my god. <laughs> privacy, please. Oh, the image is burned in my brain. <laughs> okay, we're here. Let's land in the tall grass so we don't get spotted by some redneck alien. Oh, good idea. This is a covert mission. We don't have time to waste rescuing horses or feeling bad for random kids. Right. No matter how sad it makes us. Right. Our friends are literally running for their lives. It's all up to all us. All right, I know. I said I get it. Jeez. We're landing in the grass. <laughs> <laughs> and that, yeah, for real, child, is my origin story. Well, that was kind of a detour to the current situation I'm dealing with, but now I understand. Darth Plagueis. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Dude. Okay, real quick, I'm going to go off on a little bit of tangent here. Episodes 1 through 6 all dealt with, like, something, like, kind of like Palpatine. You know, like, Palpatine was, like, the main overarching enemy. So imagine if this was Plagueis. Because we've heard Palpatine talk about Plagueis being so powerful, right? And as far as the canon goes, Palpatine is the strongest Sith we've seen so far. So imagine uh, Palpatine's master. Just imagine how much powerful he could probably be. And that's why it makes so much more sense for it to be, like, Snoke. If, 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 you know, Palpatine failed in killing Plagueis like he initially thought, I just think, initially, I was like, I kind of hope it wasn't him, and I was okay with it being a new character, but I think it just makes ten times more sense if it was Pal if Palpatine's, like, former master. Do you know, that's how he's become so strong. That's why he's so powerful. Do you know, that's what they needed. 
And unfortunately, um, Ryan Johnson didn't deliver on that. So, oh well. I still think it might be like some type of. I, I think hey, Plagueis. It could still be Plagueis. You know, J.J. Abrams could still turn it around and make it Plagueis. You know, I think that'd be cool. But I don't know. Parents were nothing. They were drunkards. <laughs> they sold you for drinking money. I don't seem to remember my granddaughter ever being sold for drinking money. <laughs> what? <laughs> Who are you? I'm Obi Wan Kenobi. This here is my granddaughter. <gasps> That's not true. Really? That's impossible. So it's your feelings. You know it to be true. Now, as I was trying to tell you before, <laughs> these are your first steps. And your true parents are... Oh, no. You're a grandfather, too? Oh, not this again, Anakin. Every time. I'm so happy for you! I'm so happy, too! We're both so happy! <laughs> Let's tell everyone! Do you want to tell everyone? Of course! Please don't. Ben, did you hear the news? Uh, is that... My grandfather? My grandfather! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, no, they can't do that. <laughs> that was doing? that would just solve Sir, everything. <laughs> this is Admiral Akbar of the Republic Fleet with an urgent communicate, Commander Hux. Good Lord, not this again. What do you want, Commander Hux? Do you know what this is? What are you talking about? None of us can see you, Akbar. Do you know what this is? What? What is? Do you know what it is? It's a. It's a what? It's a. <laughs> what are you doing right now? It's a. Yes! Dude, for real, Akbar should have done that. That's how Akbar should have died. Let's be honest here. That death was reserved for him. Oh, I just lights off my hand. Oh, you know what? That would make sense because, you know, in, in, in the second movie of each trilogy, a Skywalker loses their hand. And although technically, Solo, uh, Ben isn't actually a, a Skywalker with his last name. He is the blood of Skywalker. That would make sense. He should have lost his hand there. Boom. Oh, that would have been good. I saved you, dummy. What, what, what do you think I was trying to do? It's not about winning. It's about saving the ones you love. That's what I was trying to do. Akbar did the exact same thing earlier. Let's kiss. What the? No! <laughs> Shall we let him go? Uh, no. No. Yeah, I wonder why this guy's oh, in dang, fire at them. Finn and Rose just died. Finn and who? <laughs> what did you think was going to happen? That I would take on the First Order with nothing but a laser sword? Yes. That's exactly what I thought was going to happen. That's what should have happened. That actually does sound pretty awesome. Okay, let's do it. This place is dead anyway. But first, let's get one for the road. <laughs> oh, let's go! All right, all right. We can go. Let's get one for the road. I'm gonna miss you the most. <laughs> I want every gun we have to fire on those two. Do it. That's impossible! He's never been seen having that force ability before. Well, we have all seen you do that before, so it's not too crazy to think he can do that. <laughs> Shut up, Carl! Nobody asked you! I love no. Star Wars fans. Yeah, that would be cool. No. Bring me down. No, 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 come on. <laughs> What is with you and lightning all of a sudden? <laughs> is that it? Let's get the last little secret here. base on a nearby planet that we are trying to reach. So nobody freak out or start a mutiny or anything. We actually have a plan to survive. Oh, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's so true. That's probably one of the biggest, the biggest things about that movie that really made me mad. 
in particular was uh, the fact that she was so secretive. But dude, there you go. That was that was good. That was a good video. Thank you guys for recommending that one. Um, hi, she. Good stuff. Keep up the good work. I liked your ending scenario. I think that that was a pretty good possibility. I like the fact that um, Luke and Ray are just like teamed up right here. Look, look at why is this not a thing? Why? Why wasn't this a thing? Honestly, was it that hard to let Luke and Ray just have have like fun at the end there? Do you know was that hard to make our heroes look good? I don't think so. Um, you know, I was I wasn't a massive fan of how they treated Luke in the Last Jedi, and although I kind of started I'm starting to accept it more, of course. As I'm watching now, I'm watching this in particular. They could, they had so many way, places they could have went with it, but instead they played it safe again. I feel, and that's just the problem with Disney, Disney's uh, Star Wars movies. They're just they're playing them safe, do you know? And I, I'm just not a massive fan with that. You know, I thought the Last Jedi was going to turn it around, but this just highlights, honestly, just how safe they play it, and it's it's sad. So I don't know. Maybe it's just my opinion, but that's how I feel. So, thanks again, Heishi. If you want to check out their channel, there'll be a link in the description below. For more Star Wars content from Net Alliance, please remember to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more Star Wars fun. But with that said, guys, I love you. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.